Hello everybody, it's Kairos Wielder, and today we are going to be filming pretty much the last part of Imperia Part 1. I finally got to this point, I don't know if you guys watched my live stream. Um, I actually filmed it with Pebble, uh, if you guys just don't know him. Um, his name is Thomas. <laughs> um, he's a great guy, he helped me all th with, with Medulla, it was great, it was fantastic, it was an amazing help. Um, so go give him some love, I'll probably put him in the description, uh, his YouTube channel or his Twitter or something like that. Um, but right now, what we're going to do is we're going to kind of just do the last bit of quests that it, you know, about part one. Uh, so, uh, if this is, you know, you haven't gotten here yet and you don't want spoilers, definitely don't watch this video. Or if you are interested and, you know, you, you kind of n want to know what's going on at the end of Imperial part one, you know, stick around. So right now, we currently uh, defeated Medulla. Um, the bat actually was the one that did this to um, Malori. Um, so we... T we, we created a thingy to teleport all the way back to the dry docks in the Arcanum, and now we're going to talk to Baba Yaga. So, let's see what she has to say. My sweet little girl. Is she... I don't care if I'm not her real mother. I raised that girl. She'll always be my daughter. Tell me, wizard, is my dear Malori dead? Oh, that's so sad. She's only mostly dead, but that's as far as my medical knowledge extends. My backwater med school didn't have semi-divine physiology 101. Well, okay. <laughs> Aww. I love how, you know, Beans is extremely, like, normal about this situation. Take Malori to the infirmary! Immediately! Wizard, go fetch Xander from the Hall of Theurgy! Now! Theurgy? Okay, all right. Well, you get a lot of gold from that. Well, you know, a decent amount of gold <laughs> uh, compared to, you know, our level. All right, so we're going to go talk to Xander, and we're actually going to go bring Malori to the infirmary. I, I do have to say, um, I I was uh, someone that really wanted to watch, you know, the end of Imperial Part 1, so I kind of know what's going to happen. Um, I actually don't entirely remember because I haven't seen it in a while. So I'm kind of excited to see you know, what's going to happen, like, live. Like, this is happening to my wizard, you know, my storyline. Like, I'm very, very excited. So we're going to go talk to Xander and see what, you know, happens. Um, you know, for those of you who are, who are sticking around, um, thank you guys. I really appreciate it. And I want to thank you guys so much for the success that, you know, has been happening because of this giveaway. Wizard 101 has been helping me out, um, you know, King's Isle. And I've just been so grateful. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, but let's see what Xander has to say. Oh, hey, wizard. It's good to see your face. Though, your furrow brow makes me feel like this isn't a social call. What's the matter, mate? Mate. There's a dead child of Raven in the infirmary? Bummer. Oh, she's only mostly dead? What the and she's slightly alive. I have just the thing. I love how, like, they talk about how she's, like, mostly dead. But she's not dead. She's just mostly dead. Like, this is, like, a thing that's going around. This vitality bolus should help us stay tethered to the mortal plane. At least, I hope it will. What the heck? I need a moment to collect a few more things. But you should get that bolus to the girl immediately. I'll meet you in the infirmary. Okay. Okay. That sounds good. Uh, all right. So we're going to try to save Malori. Um, you know, because she's only mostly dead. She's not entirely dead yet. So that means she's kind of alive. But only a little bit. Alright, so we're going to go to the infirmary, which is a room that we've actually never been to yet, which is kind of exciting. Um, it's actually across the hall, relatively across the hall from when we fought the Shadow Trickster. Just a little bit closer to uh, this, this tree that we actually don't know about. So I think it's like right here. Yeah. Alright, let's see. Let's see what this is all about. I'm going to try to stay relatively quiet, you know, because of the story. And stuff like that. Alrighty. Wow. Stay well. Always wash your... Uh, right. <laughs> what is all this fancy stuff? Uh, well, Malori's almost here, right here. That... Okay. Whatever that was seems to have helped. Uh, sort of. Let's do some more stuff. It was a dose of pure life energy. It should help stabilize her mortal body. But I can't speak to her divine luminiferous essence. That's a lot of big words. <laughs> I need to perform a theurgical examination. Everyone, be quiet. Be absolutely still. Is he talking to all of us in our minds with... Will? Anything? Is my Valori going to be all right? Wow, that was like without, you know... Her body suffered great trauma, but it's nothing we can't treat. I can't say the same for her divine spirit. Wizard, I need to talk to you. 
they do a lot of like you know interactions with like the actual magic of Wizard One One. So they're like using thermaturgy and like you know divine and stuff like that. It's kind of cool. Um, like third, just and all that. Malori's divine spirit is being pulled away from her mortal form by an energy unlike any I've ever experienced. She's dying. That's not good. Did my screen freeze? Oh. Great acting. Pure, pure sadness right here. What is that over there? Do you guys see that? He, whoever has this is, you know, certified to be, you know, and clearly certified to be, you know. Just to make sure that, you know, she's not mostly dead, you know? Uh, no. So bright. What the heck? She's putting up a strong fight, but her only hope is for someone to go to the astral plane and help her. Oh my god. And that's so cool. Like, we're actually part of this situation right now. It's not like we're invisible. Impossible! The astral plane is the space between existence and nothingness. No one of the spiral can enter the astral plane. She's doomed. That's terrible. You're mean. Okay. You're right, Kyburn. Spiral beings cannot enter the astral plane, but the wizard isn't from the spiral. They're from Earth. Yo, this is, like, crazy. Like, the fact that, like... Okay. What? 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 This revelation is making me confused. Yeah. But there will be time for answers later. How does the wizard get to the astral plane, Xander? Ooh. I'm afraid I'm out of my depth on that one. But an astral portal would be a good start. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, that's me! I can set up an astral portal. No problem. Everyone stand back. Okay. This is gonna rip a hole in space-time. Right. Voila! Juliana Smogolis! I wonder what the, that, those words mean. Oh, wow. <laughs> it worked! Right. Hello? Mom? Mommy? Aww. Uh, wha what are you waiting for, wizard? Go through the astral portal. Save my girl. Aw, this is so cute. Alright, we're gonna go try to save her. Yo, look at the... Look at that. It's That's intense. Alright, I love how there's nothing right here. Like, that's how you know it's literally just like a rip through the game. Hello? What's happening to me? Whoa. Where am I? You are home, my child. Mom? Is that you? Am I... me? You're more you than you've ever been, my love. Your old life is over. Now it is time for you to realize your destiny. Destiny. Uh... Cool? I refuse to let this feud between Spider and me wreak pain and misery upon the Spiral any longer. This ends now. Yes! Now we're cooking with fire, Mama. I'm sick and tired of seeing good people being hurt by Spider and his shadow brats. Agreed. Spider and his wicked progeny must be eradicated. Oh, well... Don't you think that's kind of harsh? I mean, isn't Spider, like, integral to the Spiral's existence or something? He's essential. The Spiral cannot exist without Spider's darkness and chaos. This unfortunate truth is why the Spiral can never know peace. But you need no longer concern yourself with such things, my darling. Soon there will just be you and I. The days of the spiral are over. Uh, but... You! You don't belong here. Wow. That... that was actually intense. What happened? Um, honestly... I really don't know. The wizard successfully traveled through a rift in the space-time continuum to the astral plane is what happened. Right. And this time crystal captured the entire event. We can literally re-watch it at any time. Oh, but you meant what happened with the girl. Uh, my mistake. <laughs> I'll just take the time crystal to my office for safekeeping. Please, wizard, tell everyone what you saw. Okay. Okay. This is, uh, this is interesting. You saw Malori! Amongst great white nothingness, uh-huh. What else? Raven and Malori are going to end the spiral? 
I guess this is her last one. <laughs> I feel scared. Yeah. We should all take some time to process this information. There is much planning to be done. Don't tell me that's a lot. That's Do it. not wander oh. far, understudy. The Committee of Scholars will be calling for you very soon. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, that's it. That's literally the end. So we currently... So, but wait, we currently still have her body here, though. So, can I rewatch it? Oh no, I guess not. That's incredible. I feel like there may or may not be any something in here that has, like... Something to do, you know, with any, you know, theories or anything like that. Probably not, because, you know, they wouldn't really... I don't know why they would do that. Um, but, wow. My thoughts on this currently... Well, the animations were fantastic. The mouth movements were spot on. The... Oh, my God. And, and the fact that, like, they mentioned that we are from Earth and not from the Spiral shows that they're trying to, like, break a fourth wall in the game, which is amazing. What I want to know is if they were trying to do this from the very start. Because, you know, Wizard 101 has had a lot of, like, breaks, I guess you could say. Like, there's been, you know, it's been a decade, you know, that Wizard 101 has been, you know, very popular. So, I wonder if that they've had this idea, you know, this theory from the jump. Um, that's why, I'm, you know, I'm kind of, con you know, I want to see what, what they've got in store. But I'm ex super excited to see, you know, continue very soon, hopefully, uh, in period part two. And I definitely, definitely, definitely will be making very, you know, great, hopefully, hopefully long videos for you guys as soon as Test Run comes out or as soon as Imperial Part 2 comes out. I'm going to be making loads of videos. I'm going to try to find some theories for you guys maybe to, you know, before then. Um... You know, and and, and I'll, uh, I'll definitely do that for you. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Um, if you guys have any comments of any sort, uh, leave them in the comment section. Um, and thank you guys very, very much for watching. And I will see you guys in my next video. <laughs> Bye, guys.